everyone we were doing exercise 2.3 third question chapter is fraction decimal of class 7 so we have a division problems here let's start with the first question so we have to find here the answer so the 7 by 3 divided by 2 so when you're dividing a two fraction the first number we have 7 by 3 it will remain same 7 by 3 division become multiplication and that is in, in place of division you have to put multiplication sign and you have to take the reciprocal of the second number so we have a 2 a reciprocal of 2 will become 1 by 2 because 2 can be written as 2 by 1 reciprocal means you have to interchange the numerator denominator so you have to just reverse this 2 2 by 1 will become 1 by 2 so you have to multiply with reciprocal of second number which is 1 by 2 now try to cancel numbers if possible here we cannot cancel a number so just multiply them so 7 ones are 7 and 3 twos are 6 so we'll get 7 by 6 but this is a improper fraction right numerator is greater than the denominator so we can write this in a mixed fraction so we're gonna get 6 here 6 ones are 6 and we have to add one more to get 7 so 1 1 by 6 is the answer second one 4 by 9 divided by 5 so the first number will remain same 4 by 9 division become multiplication in place of 5 we're going to take the reciprocal of 5 which will be 1 by 5 same as the first question we had a 2 we have we have a 5 now try to cancel numbers if possible we cannot cancel a number here so we're going to just multiply the numbers so 4 ones are 4 and 9 fives are 45 now this is a proper fraction so we cannot convert this into mixed fraction so you can leave it like that 4 by 45 is the answer then the next one third question so here we have 6 by 13 divided by 7 so first number will remain same 6 by 13 division become multiplication reciprocal of 7 is 1 by 7 so can we cancel a number here here also we cannot cancel so multiply them 6 ones are 6 and 13 7 is 91 so 6 by 91 is the answer then the next one fourth question 4 1 by 3 divided by 3 so first I'm going to convert this into an improper fraction so 3 4 is a 12 12 plus 1 is 13 so 13 by 3 divided by 3 so this is equal to so first number 13 by 3 will remain same division become multiplication reciprocal of 3 is 1 by 3 so can we cancel numbers here no so multiply them so 13 ones are 13 and 3 threes are 9 now this is improper fraction so we're going to write down this in a mixed fraction so 9 will come in denominator so 9 twos are is 18 it's quite greater so we're going to take 9 ones are 9 so 1 will be the whole number so to this 9 how much more you should add to get 13 because we have 13 in the numerator so we have to add 4 more so 1 4 by 9 will be the answer or you can even leave at this number if you don't have to convert you can leave it 13 by 9 even that is correct answer if your teacher insists to convert this into a mixed fraction then you can convert it then the next one fifth one so 3 1 by 2 divided by 4 so here also we're going to convert this into an improper fraction so multiply 3 2s are 6 6 plus 1 is 7 so 7 by 2 divided by 4 now we're going to divide this 7 by 2 the first number will remain same division become multiplication take the reciprocal of 4 which will be 1 by 4 now you have to multiply so 7 ones are 7 and 4 twos are 8 so 7 by 8 is the answer now 7 by 8 you can see it's a proper fraction so we don't have to convert this into a mixed fraction then the last one sixth one 4 3 by 7 divided by 7 so multiply this 7 4s are 28 28 plus 1 is 31 so 31 upon 7 divided by 7 so first number will remain same 31 by 7 division become multiplication take the reciprocal of 7 which will be 1 by 7 so can we cancel numbers here no so just multiply 31 ones are 31 4 and 7 7 are 49 this is proper fraction so we cannot convert this into mixed fraction so that's it so this is the answer
I hope uh, like we have done all the problems so I hope it's clear how to divide it to fractions in case you have a further questions or doubts you can drop a comment I'll try to answer it thank you so much for watching